Greetings YouTube viewers, my name is Thor Wilkins from the Thorniverse and welcome to Pokemon Heart Gold. No, this isn't the Nuzlocke I did over four years ago. That file sadly lost. This is a randomizer. I've never done a randomizer before and in celebration of Pokemon Day coming up in nine days as the recording of this video and the Johto region's 25th anniversary. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and turn on your notifications so you know whenever I upload or whenever I premiere. This is my first official upload in over a year. Let's get right into this. Where's my remote? Yawn. What is it? It's already this late? It's only 11 a.m., dude. Calm down. Are you a boy or a girl? I'm gonna go as a boy, Thorky, going downstairs and getting everything we need from our mom. The bag, the options, the trainer card, uh, the safe settings. So now we have to go next door and go to Professor Elm. What Pokemon are they gonna start me off with? Touch a Pokeball to see what's inside. Monferno, Metapod. <gasps> oh, I'm definitely choosing Kingdra. Oh, we're off to a good start so far. Gonna receive Kingdra. Yes, we're gonna give it a nickname. <laughs> See, King. I know it's a real Pokemon, but whatever. <laughs> the Sea King. That's the name of the official Pokemon as well. Mom, look what I got. Kingdra greeted your mom. Hey, what's up? Yep. You have to do this in order to get past uh, the first route, because I think the kid will just stop you. Oh yeah, duh, and the Poke Gear. Forgot about this, I'll give you my number. Alright. Now let's go to the grass and find our first encounter. But, uh... Did I say I was doing a randomizer nuzlocke? I don't know. I'll make my decision once I get the Pokeballs. And I know you can't get Pokeballs until after you defeat your rival. What is our first encounter? Oh, nice. Might as well defeat this just to get the experience. Bruh. Oh, nope, nope, never mind. Run, run. Bide? No thank you. So the... Mm. I'm still thinking if I should do a... <gasps> randomizer Nuzlocke or not. Water gun is stronger than bubble. Spite? Oh, screw you. I need the experience. Okay, got the running shoes from this guy. And I'm just going to enable auto run. There we go. Oh, he's going to give me the map this time. The map card. Now let's make our way up to Mr. Pokemon's house. If anything good happens, I'll let you guys see it. I was just ready to just fast forward skip all this crap. Um, I'm not going to be able to defeat that. Not with water type moves. Let's go to... Really? Alright, made it to Mr. Pokemon's house. He's gonna give me an egg. It's supposedly the Togepi egg, but it's not gonna be Togepi when I hatch it. And I got the Pokedex from Professor Oak. Now, let's go back to Cherry Grove City and see our rival. Eventually. And right about here, yep. The rival will show up. I wonder what he got. You got a Pokemon at the lab. What a waste. 
That's a Pokemon that's too good for a wimp like you. Did you get what I'm saying? Well, I too have a good Pokemon. I'll show you what I mean. Alright. What do you have, buddy? What do you have? Fisher Antoinette. Slowbro! Level 8? My water attacks ain't gonna do shit to you! I'm not using physical attacks. I don't have it! He has Curse, Growl, and Tackle. I have to use a potion. I've used, like, four smoke screens, and he hit me with two tackles in a row. That was edited out. You guys didn't see it, but... Okay, the Growl missed. And my Water Gun does seem to do a significant amount of damage. Well, not that much. Yawn, Growl, Curse, and Pack by that. That did 13 damage. I'm good. I'm good. Come on. Come on. Yes! <sighs> nice. Level 8. Am I going to go to level 9? Two full levels in this battle. Huh. Aren't you happy you won? Or are you happy you won? Made it back to New Bark Town without getting any encounters. And now, we're here at the policeman. They're investigating the missing Pokemon. Hey, Professor Elm, how come you didn't tell me you had a Slowbro? Norge was his name. Yep. Find this individual, which you will never find. Alright. Let's give him the egg, and let's get out of here. We get our first... <sighs> then we gotta talk to our mommy. Fine. Save my money. Even though I, I'll be getting calls from you every 10 seconds about you spending my friggin' money. Now let's go learn how to catch Pokemon. Now, I've made a decision. I will be doing a randomizer Nuzlocke here. I already know the traditional randomizer Nuzlocke rules. Pokemon die, they're released. And this sucks. My Sea King is about to die. I'm, I was trying to leave. Well, this will count as my Route 29 encounter. Come on. Oh. oh shit. Water Gun would have done more damage. I was trying to leave to go heal Kingdra. I'm not gonna catch this with five Pokemon. Never mind. Me and my big mouth. Okay. Let's go back home and let's heal up. How about Sneaky? Oh, it's a female. Okay, never mind. It was actually in Professor Ohm's lab, not inside uh, the. Uh, not inside my house, actually. Okay, what are your moves? What do you have? Lick, Spite, Hypnosis. Oh, you are a quiet nature. Okay, yeah. Okay, I'm putting you up front. I'm gonna regret this, but I'm, I am know I'm gonna lose you in, like, five seconds. Oh, come on! A fucking scissor! I've seen Pachirisu, I've seen Gengar... Who else? I forgot. Forget it, let's just go. Gengar was my Route 29 encounter. The Pokemart. Hey, what do you need? I am definitely gonna need more potions. I think you sell Pokeballs, don't you? Heal Ball? That would work. Okay, up. How about three of those? There we go. Now we're going to Route 30. Route 30. What is my first encounter? Wow, no Pokemon in that area. I was gonna say, I don't have a repel. Who is it? 
Ah, oh, the Dragonite again. All right, let's go. Let's go. I'm getting you. Oh, you better not quit. Yeah, I swear to God. Lick. Blech. Hey, I was gonna paralyze you. Aww. One minute, 37 seconds later. Will this work? Come on. Come on. Yes. Dragonite is my Route 30 encounter. Drake. Just Drake. <laughs> Alright. Let's... Wait. Oh, I'm paralyzed. Uh, let's go back to the Pokemon Center. Just these three for now. First trainer battle. I'm gonna lose somebody here. Someone's gonna die. Entrepreneur Kim. Level 6 gas. Yeah, I'm dead. No? Ah, switching into Sea King. You're gonna use Spite? Yeah, but it but it failed. Alright, water gun. Kingdra, you can easily take this thing out. And I'm gonna get paralyzed. Never mind. Ah, let's knock Mountain Gate over with. I almost lost Shiniki. Entrepreneur Kim. I made a Pokemon that can fight! And I'm not gonna accept your phone number. Nope. Gengar, you're gonna make me sneaky. Sorry, you're gonna make me use up all my damn potion. Well, you're a Pokemon trainer, right? Let's get it! As always. Badoo. This is gonna be a long battle. Alright, like four twisters and a wrap took them out. Leafeon? Wow. Okay. Okay. Tail whip on me. I know your physical attack stat is high. Thunder waving you. And how about a wrap? Just do some little damage. Yeah. Tackle. Yep, I'm dead. And I lost Dragon! I knew it! I need to have faith in my Pokemon a little more. Just go right through here, go through here. Yep, get in the battle. I lost Dragonite. I have to go back to the Pokemon Center. I have to release him. Goodbye, Dragonite. Dragonite was my encounter on this route, and I just defeated a Swina, but... Now, do I dare battle this trainer and lose another freaking Pokemon? Route 31, what is my encounter? Oh, ho, 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 my God. Uh, I'm putting you to sleep right away. Dragon Reach! Oh, no, I lost. I lost this fucking run! Uh, no, 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 no. I'm gonna- I can't escape! One Dragon Rage and I'm fucking dead. I'm running. No. Oh my god! Consider this run over, everybody. Consider the run over. Consider the run over. You couldn't have given me that? First. So how's your guys day going so far? Trying to go to Violet City without any freaking problems here. You couldn't have even given me that in the beginning. I have to release Gengar. 
Shaniki, it was nice knowing you. I am down to only one Pokemon. I would get the eggs from you, Primo. But I don't know if I can. Alrighty. I need Pokemon on my team. Route 32. This is the only grass patch here. Whatever I see here will be my entire Route 32 encounter. Okay. I'm just gonna have a whole team of water type Pokemon, aren't I? Me and my big mouth. It was a crit. Got a critical hit wishing to be praised. No. All right, let's go to Sprout Tower, I guess. People are training upstairs. Okay, more water types, huh? I know I like water type Pokemon, but give me a fucking break. Okay. Me King. Sea King, meet me King. Sassy nature. Special defense is pretty easy to raise. Oh, bubble, mud spore, and vice grip. Now, what Pokemon do you have? Are you fucking kidding me? You have a grass type. Yep. Bye, me, King. It was nice knowing you. Damn it! Now oh, there we go. That was pretty easy. Lady Buff. That, that was kind of hard, not gonna lie. Goodbye, me, King. I only knew you for like two minutes. You know what? I'm I'm just gonna get the eggs from Primo. I I I need Pokemon. Badly. And I think it has something to do with the uh, words you say to him and the IDs. Hello, I should be a very familiar face to Pokemon fan, TV show, the show, me, and Primo, big brother. Yeah. First, I need to look at my trainer ID. I'm gonna look this up. Duskull. Slugma egg. Pseudo-Wudo egg. Okay, cool. Now. I know I'm only limited to Route 29... 30, 31, Violet City, and Route 36 to the west of Violet City. However, I'm going to run around until these eggs hatch. And let's see how long it takes. Uh. All right. And uh, just these three. And this sucks. What will hatch from these? That's gonna be a lot of steps. So I'm gonna be here for a while. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go overpower my Kingdra. My Sea King. I'm taking you back to Route 32, 31, and 30. I'm gonna level you up as much as I can. I've lost all my encounters so far. Route 29 was Gengar. Lost it. Route 30 was Dragonite. Lost it. 
ran from a Route 31 encounter because that was a Garchomp with friggin' Dragon Rage. I would have bulldozed through this entire Nuzlocke if I was brave enough to capture it. I also need to have more faith in my Pokemon as well. Oh, Sprout Tower's encounter is already gone as well. I forgot something. I never been in Dark Cave yet. What's my encounter gonna be in here? Come on. Okay, nice! But my Kingdra's level 12, it's gonna be knocked out. Oh no, it didn't. How about Seeker? Alright. Let's check you out. What do you have? Relax nature. Peck. A good flying type attack. Alright. Let's put you up front. And let's cue the training montage for Seeker. Even though I have a feeling you're gonna freaking die. Okay, four levels. That took me a while to do. And as the Pokemon you have seen, why did Garchomp have to be the first encounter? It is a, that was literally my death run. If I would have stayed to fight it. Four levels, I think, is good enough. Raising up Zatu, Seeker. And let's go back into Sprout Tower. I don't care about the Pokemon school. Go into the second floor of the Sprout Tower. Revival. I can't use that. That is useless to me. What Pokemon do you guys have here? It's not Bellsprout. I know that for a fact. Well, Seeker did learn Peck, so let's go. Four times super effective. Yep, there we go. Nice. Of course I get Effect Spore. Poison. Oh, no. Ow. Execute. Nope, I'm keeping Seeker in. Come on, this should do a lot of damage. Oh, knocked you- critical hit! Cool. Seeker, come on. You've been doing so well so far. So well so far? Teleport's useless to me. Actually, it can help me go back to the Pokemon Center a lot quicker. Sand Slash? Hey, guess what? Well, you're not surviving this water gun, get out of here. Alright, third floor. Kingler was my first encounter in here. I like Vespi Twin. And I lost it. Oh! Your type becomes whatever I hit you with. Color change made of the flying type. Ow. And you learned Nightshade earlier, so that's gonna come into a good. Ow. Just look. look, look. <clears throat> oh no, screw you. Screw you, I am not doing that again. I'm not losing you. You're switching out. Status conditions, critical hits, flinching. It's not fair. Two paralyzed heals. Yep, yeah, I knew it. Two paralyzed heals is going to be wasted because of you. 
Let's get out of here. I need to use a paralyzed heal on Sea King. Matang. Nope. Get out of here. Now, what's your last Pokemon? Electabuzz? Nope, not switching. I'm gonna say two water guns will knock you out. Two. There you go. I've been paralyzed. I've been poisoned. I've already lost three Pokemon. Fourth floor, which is the top. What is this? I can use that to attract Pokemon or sell it. Probably gonna sell it. And I can't escape you. We're gonna fight you and find out what you have. Only one. Okay. Seeker, you got this, my dude. Oh, you're fast. I forgot. Poison point? Oh, come on. And whenever I fast forward... It seems to screw me over. Sea King has not learned a move. I've had him for almost... Ten levels now. One Pokemon, Tyrogue, Seeker, you got it. Pack, eh, get out of here. You're done. And our rival is here as well. We're gonna get him out of the way, and we're gonna go fight the Elder. You know, this used to be an escape rope. It's an armor fossil! Wait a minute, how do I revive fossils in this game? Bruh. But he used an escape rope. I can use teleport. Alright, Elder. Let's see what you got. Skip this. Rich kid, Alex. Shelter. Oh, you may have Aurora being... Oh, do not have Aurora Beam or Icicle Spear. Withdraw. Okay, Peck's gonna do less damage. I might as well just stick with Nightshade. Oh, but I get confused. Nope. Come on. Now I've had every status condition known to game kind. Supersonic again? Well, except infatuation and burn and freeze. Right on? Nope. One water gun will put you in your place. Get out of here. Ding. Please learn a new move. Focus energy? Forget it. I need those critical hits. Let's get rid of Leer. Vibrava? Nope. Oh, you may have Dragon Breath. Sand Tomb. Oh, jeez. Water Gun, just Water Gun. Water Gun the hell out of it. Faint Attack. Got him. We win. <sighs> Come on, can I learn any other move besides Water Gun and Bubble? He's the only item that stays consistent, it's Flash. Okay, no, I'm not gonna try it on Bellsprout. Hey, Seeker, guess what? I need you to- <laughs> Fuck! Much, much later. Oh, I made it out. Running through every single encounter. Now, for those of you who want to say I cheated, no, I still have my Revival Herba, 
and their HP is still the same. I'm gonna heal up the Pokemon, and I have no idea what I'm gonna do now. I said I would run around until these eggs hatch until I found out it's gonna take a long time. <laughs> Wait a minute. Does the Ruins of the Alts count as a, a route encounter? I'm gonna have to do one of those puzzles. Yeah, Pokemon hides on the sea floor and watches the shore with eyes on its back. Wait, I gotta use the touch screen for this? Okay. And it, it, it's kind of it kind of sucks that the puzzles damn near completed for you. Wait, can you rotate these things? In the original gold, silver, and crystal, they're all blank. Yeah, you can rotate them. Done. And now, apparently unknown is the only Pokemon that appear here. <sighs> What's gonna appear? Well, did you just come down from above? So you must have solved the stone panel puzzle. That is wonderful. You seem to have some talent with archaeology. I'll give you this unknown report. It records unknown as you capture them. A shirt will come in handy. <sighs> okay, go back to your... There's a strange presence here. Go back to your cave. Replica of an ancient Pokemon. That looks like Rhydon. So the ruins of the elf, since there are wild Pokemon that can be found here, what is my encounter? Developer. Okay. Nightshade. Got it. <sighs> Delibird's only move is present as of right now, I believe. Santa Burb. <laughs> Santa Burb. Now, what other encounters are gonna be in here? Because it's not Delibird, it's a bunch of different encounters. This one's gonna be better. Oh. I can let Surskit go. So I've been running around for a while and these eggs have not hatched. And there's no grass over here. So my encounters have just been limited to Route 29, 30, 31, and 32. Just that northern section. Ooh, it, wait. I never checked Delibird. Santa Bird. Brave Nature. Oh, you have Hustle. Boosts the attack stat, but lowers accuracy. Well, let's see how long I have you in the party for. Let's go to Route 31. After I heal you. An extremely annoying shit later. I got bad news. My burb has ran out of present power points. It seems to be doing a lot of damage. Yeah, no power points. I'm going back to Pokemon Center. There is a Kabuto in the ruins of the Alphs. Really? I could've got a fucking fossil! Okay, so after a little bit of running around and training, I'm such a dumbass. Because, uh... I was informed. Delibird only learns present leveling up. No other move. But it can learn a lot of TMs. So, it's very risky, because his accuracy of present 
is only 90. And it's been a couple of hours now. Uh, let me go back to the Pokemon Center. And just heal these guys up. I don't know what else I'm going to do. I can't level up. I can't grind properly. Because all the trainers Pokemon are extremely high level. But the wild Pokemon are low level. So that's not freaking fair. Now about that thing I said earlier in the game. What's suspicious about the trainers and the wild Pokemon? I just said it. All the trainers have really high level Pokemon and every single encounter is a low level. I can't do much with these. All right. <sighs> How long have I been playing this for? Two hours and 23 minutes. Yeah. So let's just level up as much as I can. Oh, what do you want? Hey, son, I spent your money. Fuck you! Super potion. Never mind. Thank you! It's getting kind of dark. And these levels for these trainers are ridiculous. I just went inside of the Violet City Gym. I got screwed over. I almost lost my Pokemon. I beat both trainers. But the wild level Pokemon encounters and the trainer levels are ridiculous. What will hatch from this appears to move, appears to move. I've been running around for like five minutes. Let's go back to the Pokemon Center. Heal our Pokemon and then just say, forget it and go inside the Viola City Gym. I am leading with Santa Burba in this gym. Going up. Wish me luck, everybody. It's not bird. You don't have bird types. They're all freaking random. Pansy. Mine it. You have an electric type attack. I think you do. Uh, uh, Burb, why did your present miss? Accuracy of 90 and you have hustle. And you missed again. Come on, don't. Do not go out like this. There we go. Oh. Ow. Santa Burb. You can't go out like this, buddy. What? You're the present healed you? No, screw you. Santa Burb, why would you do that, you idiot? I'm not. I'm not a physical attacker. Keep growling at me all you friggin' want. Oh, I should've used focus energy. Focus energy, come on. I need these critical hits. Send your wave again! Son of a bitch. Come on, don't do this. Growl, quick attack, thunder wave. You don't have any... Ah, oh, crap. I didn't buy any fucking paralyzed heals! Damn it. Come on, just spam water gun. I don't care. I don't care, come on. Goody, you haven't been paralyzed once. Come on, let's go. 
You didn't use a potion? Alrighty, good, 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 good. Level 14 mining. Santa Burb went to level 12. It doesn't matter. You don't learn any other friggin' moves. Heracross. Uh, Seeker, you have Peck. That's four times super effective. Come on. Level 20? Oh, you fuck. Peck. Aerial Ace? Oh, come on. Come on, Seeker. Come on, you can do it. Endure? This isn't gonna knock you out. Endured the hit. Actually, it did. We can still fly. No, you can't. Endure? Endure worked twice in a row. Really? Come on. Aerial Lace? It did 21 damage. You could survive this. Yes! And we won! And we won! Seeker, thank you for seeking out the victory. Bruh. Bing, and you're level 16. My dad's cherished bird Pokemon. Those weren't birds. Zephyr Badge. The first badge completed. I've been recording for a really long time. This is gonna take me a while to edit. And it was your Pokemon to use Rock Smash. Roost? TM can only be used once. TM51 contains Roost. I would suggest Azalea Town. Alright, let's go outside. And we may get that Togepi egg. I need to make room in my party. Okay, Professor Elm. Go ahead. We want you to carry the egg. He's at the Pokemon in Violet City. Alrighty. Aw, Della Bird. He's trying very hard to keep up with you. Come on, let's go to the Pokemon Center. And Santa Burb looks very happy. Well, that's gonna do it for the first episode of this Pokemon Heart Gold Randomizer Nuzlocke. Oh, this video is gonna take a while to edit anyway. As I said, I do my own editing. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and turn on your notifications. You can go watch any of my other videos on the channel. If you guys want me to continue making this randomizer nuzlocke, I'll keep playing it. I also have a bunch more randomizers that I really want to try out. This is Thor Wilkins from the Thorniverse, and I will see all of you, and you will see me in my next video. Take care.